<clears throat> hey y'all, what is up? It's a gal, Mario. Uh, anyway, so I am getting into actually putting effort into Uto, even though I say I won't, I want to, and even though I say I'm not an MMD animator, this is all coming together for the Learn MMD Video Dojo which is dope. Anyway, so um, this is going to be inputting the lyrics into a mini file in Reaper so that you can export it into Uto and all of the lyrics will be in place so all you have to do is um, edit the UST. Now, I'm going to make another video once I sing this song, um, which will show how to do everything more exactly in Reaper with the spectrogram and inputting all of the lyric, um, not lyrics, but note names in this fashion. However, before I do that, I need to convert this to an Ultra Star song so that I can sing it. And not just sing it, but get feedback on how well I'm doing. And to do that, I need the real words and not the Uthau lyrics. Um, now, I'm going to be using a plugin for the Ultra Star conversion. So why don't I just take this, where the lyrics are, copy it, and then put them in here. The issue is little things like this. You're not supposed to use this. <laughs> when you're singing the first time through, but they included it because you need it the second time. This here, the songs will get moved here, the A would get moved here, and because there's a dash here, when you copy and paste the lyrics, this will turn into about. So this will be songs about, and rainbows will be one word again, so songs about rainbows. <laughs> and then finally and. So that's why you can't do this. And you could go through and edit this, like put an X here, but it's easier to do it right the first time than to fix it the third time around. So anyway, you can do this here, um, but I prefer to use it in here, especially when I'm copying this and this is the rainbow connection um i have to check but it says it's arranged by jack violet maybe that's the person who posted this i'm not sure okay let's go to music notation and zoom in a bit and all you have to do is click here and then control l Control L is um, Control L is Muse Score. I don't know why I was thinking that. Actually, since I'm doing this for, I think this is how you do it. This is annoying. Why isn't it doing this? Uh, and as you can see, while I was making this, I cut this out. Now let's go back to piano roll so I can show you. Um, all of the lyrics are right here. And that's what allows. And so, like I said, you can do this in the um, regular editor. But let me explain something right quick. Because this is me, if I do nothing else, then all of these notes are me. Just all of them. So... It's not that the text is assigned to one note, it's that it's assigned to every note that comes after it. And let's go back to musical notation and hope that it doesn't do that weird thing. Um, I'm pretty darn sure that there is a shortcut that I knew at some point. Song.
the plus, um, it will kind of, it doesn't matter how you input it into Uta in the first place because you have to redo it anyway. The plus is what I think you use in Ultra Star so that it doesn't um, break it up into two parts. It might be an ampersand, but I don't know about that. And then just, yeah. Yeah, this is pretty easy and boring, but um, our, but I still felt like I really need to make a video on this topic because of the fact that, you know, um, yeah, it's something that if you know about it and you're doing this stuff, it will make your life so much better and easier. But if you don't know about it, you're not going to use it. There's ions, um, but only hill. Oh yeah, and sometimes it gets you a little messed up, and you have to go back. Blue, G, no. Yeah, back. And no, <laughs> that's not it. Back and or back there. Yeah, um, navigating it can be a little difficult and annoying, but. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to learning how to sing it. This song is so difficult. You'd think it'd be easy because it's a frog singing it. Nope. So that is there, and we can just click X because that and isn't supposed to be there for the first stanza. And now we can just go forward. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude, I just realized, and I feel so good about this, I can write everything I want to with spaces here so that means that when I do it I'll be able to say and without anything to switch it over yeah, let me check how long I've been talking your ears off yeah this was meant to be a short video um, not posted as one of my weekly videos just because that'd be kind of unfair this was really boring let me wrap this up by telling you just some basic stuff. Um, I haven't been able to find a single way for um, this to export anything other than alphanumeric characters or 
the Latin alphabet, you know, with the exception of all of the things on the American keyboard. If it's on the American keyboard, it's okay. But when I've exported hiragana, it doesn't work. Like hiragana, katakana, kanji, it won't work. Um, you might be able to download some things or mess with some settings, but um, in Uta, it literally takes one click of a button with a plugin to convert from Romaji to Hiragana, so it's no big deal at all. So, you can use this for anything that uses Latin characters. And I would tend to probably start out doing this with the Utao phonemes, pho phonem, phonemes. <laughs> Um, as opposed to making this in English, but like I said, I'm going to use a plugin to convert this to Ultrastar so that I can sing it and learn it so that I can more realistically tune the cover and everyone will love hearing their little English Utahus singing all realistic like. Anyway, I hope this was helpful and I kind of hope someone finds us out and downloads Reaper just to make their lives easier when making USTs. Okay, so that's all. Bye!